all around the world, mobile devices have become commonplace. And as mobile devices become more and more common, it becomes absolutely imperative that we're able to use the same kind of intuitive gestures on our mobile devices that we uh, are accustomed to. So our learners expect it. Now with Adobe Captivate, you're able to support gestures for navigation. Let's take a look at how that works. Here I am in Captivate and I'd like to set up mobile gestures. I can do it a couple of ways. I can go to Window, and then choose the Mobile Palette, and there I'm able to check Gesture Configuration. This will make it possible for my learners to use gestures in their mobile versions of the course. You can see here that they can actually play or pause the movie by using a long tap. They can swipe to navigate left or right to the next slide or the previous slide. They can pinch to zoom so that they can zoom in on some area of the slide. They can show or hide the table of contents by double clicking. And they can also show or hide the play bar by using a long swipe up or down. This tab also lets you do geolocation. You simply check it to turn on the GPS solution. When you're done, just click OK. You can also configure the mobile settings using Publish, Publish for Devices, and then here you'll see mobile gestures. Just click it there. Same thing, geolocation. And if you just want to know if it's turned on, notice it says yes in this case because it's already turned on. And that's all there is to it. Why not get started? Try out gestures in your mobile projects today.